back in 2003, actually, I got a first job just making coffees as a barista and I fell in love with it. And since then, I wanted to keep making coffees and exploring this, uh, this amazing industry. So I've been competing for seven years and year by year, I've learned more and more. For this WBC, literally have been training for eight hours a day, three and a half months. Competing for Barista Comp is, it is to serve very nice and delicious coffee. You need to understand the taste of the coffee, but what's also very important is um, what we as a barista is how we can promote this industry further and what we can do uh, to make a specialty coffee to go to the next level. So I've used Colombian coffee, which is great. In my opinion, Colombian coffee is very diverse. There's a lot of different regions, there's a lot of different microclimates, and there's, uh, there's a lot of different varietals now these days as well. And all these things, they impact what coffee is gonna taste. After I won WBC, I actually really wanted to come here to thank the producers. And so I spent about seven days in uh, Vila and I've spent another five, five days in uh, Finca Las Nubes. That's the coffee I've used at WBC. When I was at a farm, I, you know, meeting all of the producers and people that had picked my coffee and people that had managed my winning WBC coffee, I, that was a very special moment. And I think these relationships with the farmers and the baristas and linking that bridge, what we do in the other countries and uh, highlighting work of the producers, I think that's very important for the specialty coffee. And this is something that I wanted to bring out on the stage while I was competing and presenting. So yeah, I'm pretty attached to this country, which is, which is really good. Going to Colombia almost every month a year, we can come to Colombia and cup fresh crop coffees. And that's very unique, like no, no other country in the world has that. Um, so buying Colombian coffees, we, we have the freshness guarantee them. And also we have a lot of different options different taste profiles. So I think I've been spending way too much time in this country. But every time I come here, there's a new excitement and there's new producers I meet, new relationships. And it's really exciting to be able to go back to Australia and share experiences I have in these countries. I think it's important that customers on the other side of the world understand what's, what's happening here. I've been barista for a while and my, what kept me driving is passion to improve quality. You know, be, being a barista, we, we want to chase that perfection every day. You know, when we walk in a cafe, uh, the very first coffee we make in the morning, we want to put love into that cup. This has been my philosophy. Even though I won World Barista Championships now, I want to learn more. And you know, in, in six months' time, I want to be a better barista than, than I, what I was today.